Hey everyone, today I'd like to talk about an end of the world movie from Toho from Japan. Um, I don't know, this, there's a lot of alternate titles for this movie. And when I checked on my, um, on YouTube, only one guy actually viewed this movie. So, I guess I'll be the second person. Anyway, it's called The Prophecies of Notre Dame. It's also known as The Last Days of Planet Earth. And um, there's like maybe, the, the, the seller I bought from eBay, he had two different versions of this DVD. He had like a five disc version of having a different cuts from different countries. But the one I bought was a two disc version, which is more important to me. And it's cheap anyway. This one has the uncut Japanese version, which is like close to two hours. And this, this too is the English dubbed version. And of course I watched the uncut version. Um, this movie was, if, if you're a fan of those end of the world type of movies, especially the old school ones, especially from Toho. Um, I, I think you would like this. I mean, this is alright, but it kind of, it's like more story talking. It has some moments, end of the world moments, you know. It's about this scientist. He talks about the prophecy of Nostradamus. And he's like in the, pretty much like, in the main, it's like, when you get to the end, it's pretty much he's talking in the cabinet, like, like in Washington, you know, tell, telling like the people that, hey, we have to do these things, you know to um, protect the earth or protect Japan from from never from something like this might not happen. And then you start seeing images of the scenes like what could happen, like like um floods, fire, pollution, like one there was a scene when that plane explode. But before that you also have your backstory or like a like a beginning story about in Japan, like before it was modernized, that samurai was talking about Notre Dame, he was executed. And then you have another flashback story with, with this guy from, from the war, like a soldier, Japanese soldier. He was like in prison. He's telling them, you, um, one soldier interrogating him, saying that you can't talk about this stuff. Do you really believe in what you're saying? And he's uh, renouncing Nostradamus, Nostradamus' prophecy of the Iron Cross, like the Nazis, or the nuclear atomic explosion in Japan. You know, and he's letting the soldiers know, like the interrogator know that we cannot continue like this in the war. But anyway, then you get the present time, which is what I'm talking about now, but the scientist. You also have the cameraman, who's, I think he's friends with the, boyfriend of the daughter, who's like a ballerina. And it's mainly like, it's like exploring the world about, they hear something about radiation from New Guinea. New Guinea. They said, there's said scenes where it's giant slugs from the pollution start growing big, um, giant sized bats, cannibalism. And New Guinea Island, the scientist and his crew was wondering, he's not saying that if that happened in New Guinea, it could happen in Japan all over the world, you know. Um, you also have your ending, like with the uh, top, with the mutated creature coming out the hole, you know, if the world ended with it, we might look like that creature. And it was just funny how he went after the snake and the other mutated creature like, fighting for the food, you know. Uh, it's like you have these kids start killing themselves, like suicide and stuff. Like motorcycle, like going down the river, like the water. Um, suicide by an ocean, like with the boat, let the river take them. Uh, it's like and a lot of stock footage from the movie. You can just tell it was just stock footage, you know. And um, there's like the like the narrator start pronouncing Notre Dame's prophecies. Um, the soundtrack was also good in this movie. It was definitely good. I actually like the soundtrack. It's like a haunted theme soundtrack. Like um, they talk about the food population, and you see people start rioting for food. Um, all, all in all, this is like a, a pretty, a pretty good um, for for its time. I mean, it's pretty good end of the world type of movie. Prophecy of Notre Dame. Definitely check it out. Some tell hope. Um, I mean, there's, there's a lot of them going around. Like the last one, I think, was 2012. And then you have um, The Day the Earth Ended or something. I, I forgot the movie. Um, anyway, yeah, check this movie out. Go on, I got this from eBay for selling video trash. And he sells pretty good um, DVDs or VHS transfer to DVD prints. Really good transfer, very great quality, also, by the way, guys. Um, also, got, I also ordered like three more DVDs from this seller. And I'm already planning on buying more stuff from him. I mean, Good stuff. So, yeah, if you're buying the two disc version, this is what you're going to get anyway. The uncut and the install version. Or you could get, like, I think a five disc version, which is probably like $44.
which contains these two discs and I think a jumping cut, um, a television cut of the movie. But um, yeah, if you want something simple of what the Japanese cut alone is good and the dub cut to me, I'd rather go for this one in my opinion. But anyway, peace guys and see you later.